Hey, dude, just follow my man Ralph. Again, you guys. Gematria, the Kabbalistic practice according numbers in the words. Look this up. It's all true. It's, we're not BSing. Kobe Bryant equals 157. Dead on is 157 day of his age. The word accident is 157. His nickname of his father, Jelly Bean, 157. What are the odds that the All-Star game, they set a target score of 157? Again, he's in a short film called The Black Mamba that has the slogan, you lose this road game, you don't go home. Gematria of 157. That, that poster of that movie is an exploding helicopter, just like Chamberlain Heights. There's an episode of Kobe dying in a helicopter crash. All this is before he dies. He's got all those rings. He dies at 41. LeBron wins the championship exactly 41 weeks after his birthday, after Kobe dies at 41. On the Pope's 41st day of his age while traveling from Catholic Mass, and we know the Colosseum goes back to Rome. Seriously, let's put on our thinking caps and really think about, is this stuff a coincidence or is there some kind of ritualism going? How about a big bang? Aren't the red hot chili peppers from here? Are the Red Hot yeah, Chili Peppers yeah, from yeah, LA? LA? They're from LA. The Red Hot Chili Peppers, you guys. LA band. So I'm from Seattle. I had to double check. But what's their album called? Blood Sugar Sex Magic. Blood Adrena Sugar Grove. Sex Magic. Adrena Grove. This stuff's not just album covers. They're clues about what's going on in the world. Magic, ritualism, murder, ritual sacrifice for power. These are beliefs. You don't have to agree with them, but they go back to Babylon. You guys, they're sacrificing our favorite stars at a young age, left and right. <laughs> Happens to people of all races, but if you pay attention, they tend to have a darker complexion. We need to notice, you guys, something sick is going on. Elgin Baylor got, was lucky to be older. Dead at 86, right before Baylor wins the championship with 86 points. Not a nice number, 86. Ask Hiroshima about 8'6". Ask about all the people that have been 86th in this world. Getting you guys LA? LA, man. You guys remind me of my home city. Nobody cares anymore, man. The world's changed. People don't care about truth. They just want to be entertained. We can't just march on while tyranny rules over us. Are you not entertained? Exactly. Uh, again, you guys. 16th century, it's the homework tonight after the game. 16th century, Protestant Reformation, Jesuitism, the calendar, the language. What happened here? The people escaping Catholic tyranny, starting this country, giving us a first and second amendment to protect ourselves from the tyrants that like to control speech and behavior and beliefs and kill people who disagree. Again, these warnings have been put out for centuries about the Catholic Church and the Jesuits ever since the Protestant Reformation. And like they say, those who do not know history are doomed to repeat it. We are being conquered by Rome, by an order. Gavin Newsom, the Jesuit, getting a big part of that order. Might be president one day, old Gavin. Pretty much got to be a Jesuit to get to the throne, so he's got that going. And he governs over a state that's a lot bigger than most of the nations of the world. You guys don't get it. He tells you to stay home and give up your rights and liberties. And then he's caught with his buddies doing what you can't at the French Laundry. They tell us that. Where are the Jesuits from? They're from Paris, France. 